All right, we're back for another week of This Week in uh, Survivor History, taking on the trivia titans of the new era. Back here with a guy who maybe I was a little hard on last week. The 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 consensus was with him. Here he is. It's Jordan Kalis. Jordan, how are you? You're you're off to a good start here with the the phrase "little hard on" being said in your first sentence. So it's good to, <laughs> it's good to be I, back I don't know here. What I was <laughs> <laughs> that, okay, maybe you, Jordan was right, and now I instantly regret it. Yeah, no, I, I, I was right, Rob, and I will say that I have six questions as I always do. But there's some it, shows like Press Your Luck that they're like, okay, maybe that was the right answer. Okay, pre, they're they are pre-written and the multiple choice are pre-written Come as on. well. People, uh, the, everybody that said it was bad is no fun. Okay, all right, but I have lost four weeks in a row. Much like uh, my uh, beloved New York Jets, who went 0 for November, had a no-win November, we uh, are hoping to reverse the streak here and not make it five in a row, although all for a good cause. Welcome in from Survivor 43, a guy who uh, knows, all he knows is how to win, win, win. It's Owen Knight. Hello, hello, hello. Yeah, pressure is on this week. I'm I'm not going to lie. I'm a little nervous just because... We've been taking your money week in and week out, and I, uh, I, I just, I'm not sure. Like, I'm, I've always thought I could do well at this. I used to listen okay. before I was on the show, so I'm excited. Yes. Well, Is Owen, it, yeah. thank you for being here. Uh, you're traveling, so I appreciate you making some time uh, to uh, play a little uh, this week in Survivor history. What are you up to? Yeah, I am in California for work. Um, as you might remember, I work at Tulane in the admission office, so I'm here for some uh, junior high school programs. So talking to juniors in high school about college, doing some mock application workshops and stuff like that. So um, work is good. We're getting close to May 1st, which is the uh, deposit deadline for seniors in high school. So Mm -hmm. getting ready for the summer, planning the wedding, all of that good stuff. Okay. Owen, we always invite the Trivia Titans of the New Era to play for a charity. $100 is on the line. Four weeks in a row, I have paid out $100. One hundred dollars. Actually, I paid three hundred dollars out to <laughs> freaking Jake's charity. Okay, Owen, who are you playing for this week? Yes, today I am playing for Glass Half Full, which is a local organization in New Orleans. Um, it was actually started by two Tulane students who, one day when they were drinking a bottle of wine, realized that New Orleans does not recycle glass, which is crazy oh. considering how much uh, you know liquid in glass is consumed in our in our city. Yeah. And so they started uh, breaking down glass into sand and uh, they use it for coastal restoration oh. for hurricane preparedness and pretty cool stuff. So uh, all right. yeah, happy hey, to support them. Listen, I always say to all the people that are anti-recycling, touch glass, okay, people? <laughs> Can you please? That's good. Okay. Is that what Jelinski <laughs> did when he recycled the hourglass and exactly. then returned it to the sand? Exactly. He's just working on the uh, the eco-friendliness of Survivor production there. Okay. All right. Yeah. So here we go. Um, lost four weeks in a row. Jordan, is, is there concern that maybe I have a gambling problem? I, I think I think there might be. I think the good thing, it, it, we are Whoa. recording on tax day. I think some of these donations might be tax deductible. Yeah. What, so what I, am I at? Like 600 bucks in the last couple of weeks? I, I think so. It's a, does that make, if, uh, if if Owen wins today, you will have made several donations oh to charity. <laughs> oh my God. Rob is a website.com slash patron. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You sign, sign up. Sign up. This, this actually might, go to might end. I'm, I'm going to get it all back. All that's, right. I don't think that's, that's not how it works. <laughs> it's not <laughs> the charity doesn't owe you money. <laughs> you're, Sam, you're... Is, that what, is that not how this works? Okay. <laughs> All right. How, how pissed would Glass Half Full be if, if they got an, uh, an email? <laughs> from an like, uh, unfortunately, I lost money for your, for your charity. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Okay. All right. So once again, uh, Jordan will have now we're up to episode eight. Yes, all the episode the eight in, in Survivor his, history. Yes, we are going uh, to, we have, uh, here are the choices. We have Marquesas, we have Thailand, we have, uh, going back to Guatemala, no controversy will ever uh, come from that season, uh, Survivor Fiji, 42 and 45. So, Owen, as the guest, you will have uh, your first choice in that day. Uh, Owen has the uh, seasons in the chat. Let me ask Owen also, the, Owen, could you put all the logos in order, He's serious, Rob. Of course he can. Okay, he got come it. on, he got come it. on. This is, there's come a reason now. Owen Knight's here. Uh, uh, the second Owen, I, we, I mean, we weren't doing guests when Owen's season came on, but I had a feeling at some point we would go back to guests on Twitch. And when Owen came on, I was like, this guy's going on Twitch. <laughs> okay, all right, yeah, I'm feeling good. I'm ready. All right, we shall see. All right, so I'm picking first. Yeah, picking first, Owen. 
All right. Even though maybe at this go. point, maybe the maybe the guest should should uh, the, Rob should have the, uh, the Rob go for it. Yeah. Yeah. Rob's becoming the away team. And I'm the away team. Here. Yeah. Um, let's go with Fiji. All right. We're going to Survivor Fiji. Uh, who won the? Oh, sorry. Wrong question. Uh, oh. Well, no. Well, while members of the Four Horsemen Alliance agreed to share the idol, who actually possessed it and in a confessional said it was uh, therefore his to control? So who had hmm. the idol, possessed the who? idol? Uh, who? And it's the person, obviously, there was some movement with it, but who found it? Who found it originally? Um, thinking out loud here. Well, I don't want to say too much, but I mean, it won't change you don't that worry, Jordan okay. will change the multiple choice. One, <laughs> one of the best challenges ever. Yeah. Um, I'm pretty sure it was. Mm, well, the multiple choice won't help since it's like a four person alliance. So I'm just going to go for it and say uh, Alex. Alex is incorrect. So uh -oh. unfortunately, Owen. First time uh, she was going to question wrong in like a month. I know. Uh, Rob, you can you can steal here. Okay. Can I hear the question again? Sure. Uh, while members of the Four Horsemen Alliance agreed to share the idol, who actually possessed it and in the confessional said it was therefore his to control? Um, who possessed the idol? Um, I'm going to say it was Mookie. Mookie is correct so rob you nice. start with a one zero lead that okay. is correct you feel the point that might have been a break embarrassing for me okay. that could have been the could that could have been what you needed rob going into uh you don't want you're trying to stop the bleeding here you don't want to go zero and five or zero and five in the last five weeks like the uh, it's like the Mets did to start their season so <laughs> look how they turned out they turned it around that's true okay it could, it okay. could happen so rob we have uh five seasons to choose from where okay. are you going all right, I'm going to go to 45. I know okay. that I got the 44 question recently, but I just podcast about all this stuff. It should be somewhat fresh in my memory. All right, so uh, season 45. Uh, and we're going to be talking about an episode, Rob, that we uh, we watched together. Uh, at the end of the first New Era auction, Bruce had the most money remaining and therefore lost his vote. Who began the auction with the most money at $900? So started with the most money, $900. Okay. Um, I'm gonna say, boy. Um, really between two people, but I think I'm gonna I'm gonna say, okay. I'll I'll go. Uh, maybe tit for tat here with Owen. I'll guess without the multiple choice. Maybe Owen steals one from me. But I believe it was also the person who ended the season with the most money, and I'm gonna say that it was D. So D bought a milkshake in this auction for $900, which was the highest amount. So Rob, you get two points. You have a three zero lead, but Owen is not, not over. We still have uh, four questions remaining. You can get back into this thing. All right. Uh, good job. Hold Rob. on. Your connection's getting on? a little shaky, Jordan. Yeah, I was worried that was me. Okay. But yes. Okay. Uh, oh, I'm, I'm shaking now. Hold on. Hold on. Get it hold together. On. Get it no, together. Get, uh, <laughs> Okay, what up now? When is he literally frozen? <laughs> I think it's amateur really hour. Now. Well, I guess Call since we have in. a second, yes. um, I did want to say I, I know you were right. wrong in the argument with Jordan last week. You were also <laughs> wrong wrong yes. in the argument with Nicole regarding wedding invitations. But yes. I wanted to let you know to be expecting some mail from me. And I want you to make sure Nicole knows her name was on it okay. before I heard this All argument. Right. Thank, thank you, Owen. Please, thank you. You saved me a fight. Thank you. Appreciate it. Mm -hmm. So this was not I, a I wish invitation. I had heard it before, so I could have said Nicole Sesternino and guest on the mm -hmm. invitation, but uh, <laughs> yeah, I wasn't fast done. enough. <laughs> okay. All right. So All right. To me, um, I think yes, just since out. I'm already in the hole here, I'm going to go for 42. All right. So uh, the new era contestant is, is taking the last new era question. Uh, Survivor 42, who won the first two individual immunity challenges of 42? That would be Tori. Tori Meehan is correct. Oh, and you get two points. Rob, you have a three to two lead. Good job. Uh, Tori uh, won, won the, uh, the merge at Tori. Marianne's wedding. Yes. Uh, oh, lovely. And, yeah. Yeah. Okay. I, I heard uh, a lot. Yes, a lot of um, I got got some uh, some some deets on that. It sounded like a like a great time. Heard heard about it uh, over the weekend. It's, I'm sure uh, seems seems like a lot of fun. Uh, we are going to go to the next question. Oh, wait, uh, Rob, what what question are you are you? What season are you taking? Okay, so uh, what do we got? We got uh, 
Marquesas, we have Thailand, and then we have uh, Guatemala. I'm going to yes. go to Marquesas. All right. So the Marquesa. The Marquesa. The Who was the first player eliminated from the all-important Coconut Chop Challenge? That's a tough question. That is, that is a very tough question. <laughs> If I ask for the multiple choice, um, or if I if I if I just guess straight up, does Owen get the multiple choice? Uh, if if you ask seal? for the multi, if you ask for the multiple choice, Owen will obviously know them. If you uh, don't ask for it, Owen will not get the multiple choice. Hmm. But it's still okay. a point on the seal, no matter what. Okay, then I'm gonna just I'm gonna go. I'm just gonna go for it. And I'm gonna say. The first person to get eliminated was friend of the pod, Sean Rector. So Sean Rector did catch some votes in this episode at Tribal Council. But Rob, like he said, you always bet on black. Sean Rector is the correct <laughs> answer to this question. Uh, you get... Uh, two points, a very good, a very good answer. Yeah, so they basically the uh, the 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 row two four were going in the order that they wanted to vote everybody out. So their their plan was to vote at Sean, and therefore they decided to uh, to go for him first in this challenge. Turned out to be the worst possible strategy they could have done. Uh, Rob, you have a five to two lead. Owen, you get to choose between Thailand and Guatemala. Uh, two two of my favorites. Um, let's go. Follow. We're gonna watch more recently. I think I've watched Thailand. Let's go Thailand. Let's go Thailand. All right. So we're going to Thailand. I think this is the first time I've gone to Thailand this season, if I remember correctly. Uh, who became the first juror of Survivor Thailand? The first juror. Um, I guess I'll, I, I'm going to need the multiple choice. Such a memorable cast. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So the, the first juror of Thailand, we have a, and I have not changed these. Aaron Collins, B, Ken Stafford, C, Penny Ramsey, D, Shian Wang. Well, how could you change them? It wasn't like he's like, I really think it was Jake. I really think it was Jake. <laughs> but even uh, if you said Jake, even if you said Jake, it would I wouldn't have been Jake. Jake's not in this. So Jake the Snake. One more time. Penny, yes. Ken. Uh Aaron Collins, Ken Stafford, Penny Ramsey, Shian. I don't think it was Sheehan. I don't think it was Ken. So I'm down to Penny or Aaron. And I feel like I remember Aaron less, which means I think she went less far. So I'll guess Aaron. I'll guess Aaron. Aaron Collins technically pre-merge because she was the second boot of the of the fake merge when they were all living the together. But she was the first juror. So Owen, I you get it. the point. Uh, Rob, you get the last question. It's uh, five to three, uh, okay. by the way. So I believe Rob has mathematically mm -hmm. won, <sighs> but uh, we are going now to. Uh, oh, wait, I'm sorry, but you don't know how Brutal. bad I needed this. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. I'm happy. All for right. Sorry, glass, glass half. I'm, I'm going to recycle be... all the glass in my yeah, house. Recycle all your glass. <laughs> Throw out your glass, guys. Unfortunately, they won't be getting the money. We're, we're glass, glass half empty here. Uh, Rob, Guatemala, you could run away with it here. Uh, who was voted out during the episode in which the hidden immunity idol concept was first introduced to Survivor? The uh, concept of the idol. Um, I believe, okay, I'm just going to go a little uh, loosey-goosey here. Uh, nice I, I believe it's somebody who I've been seeing on social media this week. Uh, was it Brandon? Don't call me Brooks Bollinger. So this this was basically a different way of saying who was the merge boot because the idol was introduced at the merge uh, of Survivor Guatemala. We didn't see it until a couple episodes later. But yeah, uh, Brandon Bellinger, who apparently used to be Taylor Swift's bodyguard. Uh, so Rob, you get uh, two points there. I wrote this question before I even seen that link. Uh, so pretty crazy. This is the most that anyone's talked about uh, Brandon Bellinger. And then uh, he also took a picture with like Stephanie LaGrosa, right? I saw that. Yeah, I didn't see that one. This is a huge week. Big week for for Brandon Bellinger. Uh, do you think he's related to the baseball Bellingers, uh, the, the the Clay and Clay Cody's Bellinger? Is that him? Yeah, probably. Yeah, no, not a lot of Bellingers. Not a very common last name. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But Rob, congratulations off the Schneid, okay. baby! All right. Wow. All right. I'm, I'm back. 
All right, I'm, 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 I'm trying this to go for terrible. a winning record this season. What's what? So uh, what am I? Three and five? I think you were. Yeah, you were. You were. Yeah, I'm pretty sure three and five. Uh, All right, that makes sense because we're at eight, the, eight episodes. The beginning of the rally. I'm rooting for you now because I now really I give you the only right, one. I, really, I appreciate it. This I know really definitively like, like I know more Survivor trivia than like not to call out Franny, but she was freaking out before. Oh, so shots fired! I'm, I'm mad at myself. I'm mad at myself. Okay, okay. Yeah, well, that's because, why yeah, I'm gonna get tough back tough to the showdown. Tough. So yeah, I get Owen versus Franny. Mm-hmm. We can He's calling her out. We can do She's it. way smarter than me, but she has not mm-hmm. watched as much Survivor as me. Yeah. So, but need, oh, and even you said when out. when Brando said, "Hey, everybody, let's go on, let's go on the internet and see how fast we can name a hundred survivors." Even you were like, I- "I'll pass." No, no, I did it. I oh, did you it did it in five and a half minutes. Oh, but that's I, pretty good. Yeah, I but I felt I was immune from the uh, the shit talk about it since I'm in my thirties. Yeah, and it's uh, being in my thirties makes it much more appropriate to be in on Saturday night. <laughs> browsing twitter <laughs> yeah i concur and i i i feel i feel that i think it's a totally totally legitimate way to spend your mm-hmm. uh, to spend your night mm-hmm. i don't think i know that many people's last names i think i would struggle with the last names mm-hmm. and the spelling the spelling was tougher spelling, than I yeah we do yeah. we do have ta- talking about uh something where you do once in a while need to know the last name of a certain survivor we have okay. a verbal rebus. all right lay, lay it lay it on us rebus Philbin. I, I love how the, the guests are so in on all the uh, the inside uh, twist jokes where, where we have people talk, uh, JD saying, oh, we know Kalish loves Guatemala. And then we also have, uh, you know, uh, Omer, unfortunately, who didn't get the verbal rebus. I have sent him his verbal rebus now. He has his verbal mm-hmm. rebus. So oh, he did get, get his, his own personalized one. Yeah, okay. I was I was sad, too. That was unfortunate. But um, here we go. The winner of Survivor Gabon. Plus okay. the David plus the David tribe member who quit due to injury. Mm-hmm. Okay. Plus, there were two men with this first name on Vanuatu. Okay. Plus, Michaela did this while JT was getting voted out. Mm-hmm. I know what the last name is supposed to be, but mm-hmm. okay. It was so she she did something with okay. that. Okay. Okay. Yep. All right. Yep. It's a it's a stretch, but okay. Um, yeah. Plus, the only Karor player to be voted out pre-merge. Mm-hmm. Okay. Minus the youngest member of the millennial tribe. I think he was actually a Gen Z. If you're okay. Being... So okay. So what? Do, who do we have here? Okay, Bob is the winner of Gabon. Uh, yeah. B. Uh, yes. And then two uh, yes, two Johns. Okay, Bobby, Johns. Bobby yeah. John. And then Michaela was drinking or drink, drink, drink. drink. Yeah, yeah, drink. I thought and sipping, then, but yeah, yeah, I, I yeah. Got there. yeah. She was the and then yeah. and then Willard, Willard minus minus Will. Yeah, who do we have? Bobby John, Bobby John Drinkard. Drinkard. Bobby John Drinkard. Who? Uh, who's drunkard? I think it's Drinkard. No, it's Drinkard. It's, it's, drinkard. Not, it's definitely not Drunkard. <laughs> I thought it was Drunkard. Yeah, the it's the Bobby most Drunkard. eligible bachelor in Mobile, Alabama, or whatever yeah. it was. And also, uh, got it was was good friends with uh, uh, Brandon Bellinger, who who uh, again gets mentioned here on on Twitch. So very good job on the verbal rebus, Owen. You got three points. There there have been guests who've gotten fewer than three points. So you did you did a good job. You you, you clearly know your stuff. Three once again. Um, but Rob <laughs> Rob needed yes. Rob needed the W, especially after being so one. so this wrong was, so uh, wrong in his mistakes last week. Me. Yeah, I'm yeah, glad so to Rob, be Rob, the uh, momentum shift in your season, Rob. Yes, this could be These the turning the first, point. These questions were the first thing. Rob, Rob has gotten so many things wrong in the la- in the last two weeks, and, and finally <laughs> he gets something right. Finally gets his W. Well, I'm happy okay. to provide. I'm happy to provide. But this All is right. fun. This, those were yes, tough. Those always, were good questions. Always a good sport. Thank you for being back with us. What else is coming up for you? Not a whole lot. I mean, I'm coming to Chicago, so very excited oh, for that. See yeah, you soon. yeah. Mm-hmm. Yes, I will see you very soon. A couple weeks here. Very excited for that. And then, um, oh, someone's trying to come into my hotel room. Sorry. Hi, I'm in here. Yeah, no, I'm good. Okay, thank you. Thank you. That was a first <laughs> Sorry, guys. On the podcast. Wow. That's little, little. You got uh, the do not disturb. 30 p.m. housekeeping. Sorry about that. Um, so yeah, coming to Chicago. Looking forward to that. Just and uh, just living my life. Ready for the make, wedding. And make sure they don't tuck in the sheets too tight. Different. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Yeah. I guess. I mean, all the pillows are fluffed. I haven't used a towel yet. So yeah. I don't know what she's doing in here, but um, anyway, this was fun. I'm I'm glad to be here. <laughs> Sad to lose, but it was a good time. Okay. All right. Well, we'll Owen, thank you we'll for back. coming back. 
All right, yeah. Jordan, Anytime. what about for you? Uh, you could you could follow me on Twitter at Jordan Kalish. As always, I uh, we we do the uh, New York uh, viewing parties. Uh, last week, if you were there, you got to uh, h- hang out with uh, with with Shannon and Peter Gus. That was always a great that was a great time. Uh, good to see them. And uh, well, you know, we sometimes yeah. don't always have special guests, but we always have people. We have uh, always have a lot of people. We always so have it's, people. Uh, it's fun. It's a fun night. Uh, so yeah, check it, check it out. And, uh, yeah, Sam said we can tease club condo coming soon. Yeah, too. First so, of all, nobody else condo. is supposed to read what <laughs> Sam writes in the chat. That's for me to read. Club Not condo, baby. Blurt it out. Yes. <laughs> that was for uh, Owen. That was for Owen. Sorry, Owen, you're supposed to tease club. Uh, condo. I got distracted tease. by the housekeeper. Owen's yes, going to be very uh, excited. Yes. Yes, you uh, that, you I'm always going to be doing some some housekeeping with me and Chappelle on Club okay. Condo very soon. Okay. Well, yeah, that, that'll be that'll be a lot of fun. So good, Sam. We did it. Uh, that was for okay. Very good. Great. We All did right, it, guys. Great. We did it. All right. That's this week in Survivor history. Thank you for that, checking out the podcast. We appreciate you uh, listening to the podcast version. Of course, we'd love to read your comments here on the YouTube channel. So don't forget to like and subscribe uh, if you haven't done so yet. And we'll be back with a busy Thursday. Don't miss uh, the uh, know-it-alls and everything else coming up here on RHAP. Thank you so much. Take care, everybody. Have a good one. Bye.